Mind your decisions, Presh Tollwalker here. This problem is adapted from the Tesba test in Argentina, and I thank Pedro for suggesting it. Every day at 7 a.m., Pedro walks from home to school. On Monday, he walks at a rate of 95 meters per minute, and he reaches school one minute late. On Tuesday, Pedro makes the same walk at 105 meters per minute, and he reaches school one minute early. Then on Wednesday, Pedro walks at some rate and he reaches school exactly on time. There are two parts to this question. First, what time did Pedro reach the school on Wednesday? And second, what speed did he walk on Wednesday? Pause the video if you'd like to give this problem a try. And when you're ready, keep watching to learn how to solve this problem. We'll get started with the formula that distance is equal to rate times time. This is usually abbreviated d is equal to r times t. On Monday, Pedro walks at a rate of 95 meters per minute and reaches one minute late. So the distance is equal to the rate of 95 multiplied by the time of t plus 1. We have a similar equation for Tuesday. Here the rate is equal to 105 and the time is equal to t minus 1 because he's one minute early. Now we focus on the system of two equations. We'll distribute the rates, and then we'll solve by subtracting the second equation from the first. This eliminates the variable d. We get 0 is equal to 10t minus 200. We then solve for t. We add 200 to both sides and then divide by 10. So t is equal to 20 and we're dealing with minutes. So t is equal to 20 minutes. Since Pedro starts every day at 7 a.m., that means on Wednesday, he reaches at 7.20 a.m. That's part one. Now, on Wednesday, he goes at some speed and reaches on time. What was his speed? We'll go back to the equation for Monday and substitute in for the time. We then solve for the distance d as 95 times 21, and that'll be equal to 1995. We can then use our equation d is equal to rt on Wednesday, and we need to solve for r. So 1995 is equal to r times 20. We then solve for r, which will be 1995 over 20, and we get the answer of 99.75, and that will be meters per minute. So here are the two answers. Pedro reaches at 7.20 a.m., and he goes at a speed of 99.75 meters per minute. It's a pretty fun problem. Thanks for making Mind Your Decisions one of the best channels on YouTube. Thanks for watching and thanks for your support.